baseball from Chili Bomb Stadium in Fayetteville. The 10 and 4 Arkansas Razorbacks ready to host the Golden Flashes of Kent State. Uh, freshman in Bryce Bonnet is off to a good start. Yeah, Bryce Bonnet's got an electric arm. You're going to see Double him beat. Doesn't matter. That's ball four. Back to back three passes. And a good beginning for Kent State. There's the bunt towards third. One play that's first. And Gates just did keep his foot on the pillow. And Parks. That one's hit well to the field. Back goes Kerstead nearing the fence. He'll make the catch. Hawkins will tag and score. And Kent State on the board first without a hit. And then a ground ball to second. Shanty will in the inning. Took some work for Bryce Bonin. Liner to Biggers, and he picked that one off the dirt. Caught it cleanly for out number one. See where it would create some torque as well. He'll field the comeback. And you'll have a perfect second inning. That won't do it to O'Brien again. Hawks have left four men through two innings. And Murray in the goal. Rip it a miss. Second strikeout for Bonham. Uh, really got to make him earn it. Shaddy up the middle with the backhand. With the throw, it's offline. Gates, how did he miss first base? They call him save. Hawkins able to get that left. There goes Hawkins. Up the middle. This may result in a double play. Biggers will tag the base with his glove. And he flips the first for the quick killing. He got the double play the hard way. Spears this ball, and then from his knees, throws the runner out at first. Murray working quicker with nobody on base. A liner in the left center for a base hit. Shortstop, Hollander couldn't get it. Cole's going to try for two. There's your answer, Troy. Nothing. Murray working from the full windup. This should do it. Chopper to second. Someone's got to get over and cover. Murray racing, didn't even get to the bag. Bonfield safe. Murray's route to first. Fletcher flight up to the track in center as last time in. He'll send this one back near the track. Two times he has not squared up balls and still just missed by a couple of feet on a sack bunt in the first inning. Swinging here, chopping one up the middle. Another play for Shaddy. This is going to be a real tough throw. Great extension by Gates, but not in time. Soft liner, right to bigger. Throw back to first. I think they got him. And did double play. It's a strike, but it needs to be a fastball. Wave it a miss. Or a slider. Yeah, it worked. There's a delayed steal. And out at second base is Cook. And look, no, the throw came loose. That ball's still rolling. We've had bodies down. That breaking ball kind of rolled up there, but O'Brien has been very busy at second base in the inning ends. Arkansas has stranded six men in the game, so we went for a quick one here in the fifth, but he's fallen behind 3-0, and and he just walked a 216 hitter. Two out. Shaddy pursuing. This one will drop in front of Cole. And there's runners on the corner. Texas native Cole Ramage inherits a couple of base runners with two outs here in the fifth inning. And the bases are loaded. Hawkins has been on all three times. That's trouble. Into right center field, and it's going to score a couple of runs. And Kent State has a 3-1 lead. And two Florida. Ground ball to third, a bobble from Martin. Needs to hurry the throw, and he didn't get him, and that'll let another run score. Here's Evan Lee, the third pitcher of the inning for Arkansas. Yeah, Dave Van Horn trying to go with the lefty-lefty matchup. Graded his team as B- minus so far through this season. That was up there a long time. Who wants it? Shaddy starting to back pedal. Oh, my goodness, he held on. That was trouble. That was an adventure right there. Some by of these Shad games this year. Kirsten sends one down the right field line. In for a base hit. Over to cut it off, though, is Cannabis, and he will keep Kirsten to a long single, even though that throw was making pay with one off the scoreboard. He gets a curve, and that's ball four. It's fair down the left field line to the score run. Let's see if Fletcher has a chance to score. Late stop sign comes up as Hawkins plays it back in. It's a 4-2 game on the double from Casey Martin. We, we were fortunate enough to, to get an error out of that. But, uh, 
Yeah, I'm proud of the way we're, we're handling this environment and, and, and this game today. Thanks for your time, Kevin. Yeah, thank you. Rip the miss, one gone here in the sixth. Big strikeout for Evan Lee. Sold him off. Flip back to first, how about another double play? Three different versions of them. You're like, I just want to throw a strike so I can get another chance to swing. He had six walks all season coming into the game. He's walked three times. That's not going to serve the purpose, but E6 for a base runner. Smoked in the gap to left center field. This ball is going to go to the fence, and it might tie the game. Here comes Shaddy around third. Heston Kerstad delivers again, and we're even at four. Defensively, straight up. Outfield deep with the wind blowing out. Kerstad pursuing. That's a quick inning. One, two, three, and done. We're going to stretch him out. Forever holds your peace. There you go. Goodbye. On cue. Yeah, perfect. Casey Martin. In the air to left. Does it have enough? Goodbye again. Back to back. McFarland with his first of the year. And the Hogs have found the long ball stroke in the seventh inning. Just an absolute moon shot by George McFarland. That thing had some hang time on it. Shady drives one to right. This one may find the scoreboard. Way up there. And they're flying at the bomb stadium in the seventh. But he'll take it out regardless. Fletcher starts to backpedal. Fly out to right, now fly out to center. With the Another one in the air. Carson Shaddy's been busy today. Hitting over, leadoff single, and then Lee goes one, two, three, and oh, he's taking, and that's ball four. You're still fired up, I can tell. I'm telling you, it's going to be a, a great two-game series. I thought that was ball four. Kerstad just walked down to second base. Yeah, they're saying ball four. Otherwise, Kerstad just <laughs> glided to second. <laughs> that was the easiest stolen base I've ever seen. But he's doubled in a run. He's homered since. Now he's walked, and the bases are low. avail when necessary. And they see some lefties. Smoke to center. Does it have enough? Grand slam! Four will score in the bomb to center by McFarland. Fourth home run of the game, and it scores four. Big fly by Jordan McFarland. Knew he hit it pretty well. You're almost kind of thinking sack fly, at least. That's Mam what I was thinking. Mamarella goes back. To the wall. This is 40th pitch of his relief appearance. Martin will handle this one. One gone, ninth inning. Work alongside you. It was a full day of work. I bet it was. More power to you guys. There's a fly ball to right field. Ball makes the catch for out number two on the Hogs. Biggers, tough hop. No problem. Game over. And the Hogs rally to win this game and take this series. Arkansas finally broke out the power in this game, hitting four home runs, including two from Jordan McFarland, and one of those a grand slam. Just outstanding baseball to beat a very good Kent State Golden Flash team.